News of a fallen Bothell police officer was tragic enough tonight. The community is dealing with yet another blow. Investigators say that a bullet fired, not by the suspect, but by another officer, killed Officer Jonathan Shoup. Uh, King 5's Ted Land has the latest for us tonight from Bothell. The city of Bothell says this was a chaotic chain of events that played out in a matter of seconds. A volley of gunfire and an officer's bullet striking and killing his partner. They say this only happened because an armed man attacked police. Investigators are revealing new information about what happened during a pursuit and shooting that killed Bothell police officer Jonathan Shoup Monday night. According to the Snohomish County Multiple Agency Response Team, Officer Shoup, a student officer, and his partner, Officer Mustafa Kumcher, who was training Shoup, stopped a driver because the man did not have license plates on his car. Investigators say after briefly stopping, the suspect sped away, hit a pedestrian, crashed through a median, then stopped again. Shoup and Kumcher pulled up to the stopped car, lights flashing. Investigators say the suspect was walking away from his car, then turned toward the officers, rapidly approached the driver's door of the police SUV, and opened fire. According to charging documents, the suspect yelled, quote, come on pigs, as he did this. Detectives say based on what they know right now, the shooter fired two rounds into the patrol car. One of those bullets hit Officer Kumcher's gun, ricocheted and struck Kumcher's head. He's recovering from his injuries. Investigators say they believe Kumcher fired multiple rounds toward the suspect, and one of those shots struck and killed his partner, Officer Shoup. Detectives say the suspect, Henry Eugene Washington, ran away and hid on the roof of a nearby business where he called 911. Police closed in and arrested Washington, who they say admitted to shooting at the police officers. The King County Prosecuting Attorney's Office charged Washington with first-degree aggravated murder, first-degree attempted murder, and vehicular assault. The prosecutor's office says Washington's act of firing into the police car caused the officers to return fire, and that caused the death of Officer Jonathan Shoup. They say had Washington not attacked the officers, Officer Shoup would be alive today. In a statement, the city of Bothell said, let us be clear, we believe the actions of the suspect led to this tragic event. In Bothell, Ted Land, King 5 News.